Hey guys, it's Tom here from GB Games, the home of Pixel Art, and today we're doing Pedo Bear. So, this was long requested, um, so I'm going to do it today. So, the materials you need is black wool, brown wool, smooth sandstone, or if you're on Xbox, use sand because it's the closest alternative, and pink wool. So, we're going to start off by placing a four long line of black wool, like so. Then, we're going to go up diagonal and bring it up three, so it's four in total. We're then going to go across one and up one, up diagonal and to the side one, up diagonal, up diagonal again, but this time we're going to add three on, so four in total. This is what it should be looking like at the moment. We're then going to go up diagonal to the left, or to the right I mean, sorry, and up seven, so two. Seven, so it's eight in total. Then we're gonna go up diagonal to the left and add two, three in total. Then we're gonna go up diagonal to the right and add one three times. So once, twice, three times, like so. We're now going to go up diagonal again. This time we're going to add five on. One, two, three, four, five. So it's six in total. So pause here if you need to catch up. This is what it should be looking like at the moment. I'm now going to continue. So at the top, we go one to the right, down diagonal to the side two, and make it a tetra shape by pulling it down one. Then we're going to go down diagonal to the right, or to the left, sorry, I'm getting so confused right now. And down three, to the right three, up diagonal three times, on the third time we're going to bring it up three more, so it's four in total, should be looking like this. Now we're going to go up diagonal four times. Oops, got a bit of lag happening here. Or oh, computer spazzing, should I say? Okay, four times, sorry. On the fourth one, we're gonna build it up one and then to the side one, like that. We're gonna bring it over, like that. It's a three in between two. Place two on top of the middle one and punch the middle one out so it should be looking like that that's his arm or his right arm now we're moving on to his head okay so on this part we're gonna go up diagonal to the right and then bring it up nine two three four five six seven eight nine then to the left up diagonal and up two more now we're going to go up diagonal five times, oops, oops, oh my god, bad misplacement, okay, up diagonal five times, so two, three, four, and five. Now what we're going to do is bring this across two, like that, that's the corner of his head without his ear, so we're now going to go back and do his ear. So come back down to where this free part is and go up diagonal and add five on. So it should be six in total. That's three, six, like that. Up diagonal, extend by three and simply connect like so. So that's his ear. We now need to add a line here. So one, two, three and connect that so it all become apparent when we color it in basically okay so we're now going to go up diagonal and bring it out by seven so three four five six seven like that and go up one oops then we're going to go up one again diagonal this time up again diagonal and extend by three three like that 
Then we're gonna go down diagonal and add one. Down diagonal and then bring it down by five. So two, three, four, five, like so. Then we're gonna make it go off diagonal to the right, downwards. Now we're gonna quickly gonna make it here. So we go up diagonal, up to the side. Then we go up diagonal again. Now we're going to go to side 2, like that, and go up 2. Now we're going to punch them 2 out, so it's like floating. Then we're going to go up diagonal to the left and connect it. So that's his other ear. So that's his ears and one side of his body. We're going to do the outline of his body first, then do his mouth and eyes. Okay, so we're going to go down diagonal from there and down do the same again but this time add two on so it's four in total this time and the same again but this time it's three in total like that now we're gonna go down diagonal just once second time we're gonna do it but we're gonna add one below it and we're gonna do it again to the right this time and add one down we're going to bring it out by two as well. Now whilst we're here, we place one up diagonal there. We then bring this down two, so it's a square. And extend by five. Three, four, five. My computer fans have just gone a bit crazy, so I apologise for that. Now one in, we're going to place one. Leave a gap, place another one. Come down, place one below it. So that's what it should look like. Now we're going to come down diagonal, like that, down diagonal again and down, then we're going to go, oops, down diagonal again and bring it down 7, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Let's just double check that, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, good, so it's 8 in total in case I forgot to say. Down diagonal to the right, down diagonal again and to the side one. Then we're going to bring it down 11. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Like that. Now we're going to go down diagonal again to the left and bring it down 4, so 5 in total. Oops, like that. Down diagonal to the right and extend by three. Can't place it. There we go. Then we're going to go up diagonal and build three up. So four in total. Then we're going to go up diagonal and add one. Then we're going to go up diagonal four times. So once, twice, three and four like that on the fourth one we're going to bring it up two and to the side one in the middle we're going to bring it out two to the right and we're going to go down diagonal to the right down again and bring it down one now I'm actually going to go down to the bottom and just bring it up because it's easier so we're going to go up diagonal and to the side one up diagonal and up two up diagonal and to the side one up diagonal and up three on top of that so it's four in total up diagonal to the right and up one and we're gonna up diagonal to the right again and up two then we're going to connect it by going diagonally up to the left. So this is what he looks like with no detail. So he's missing his arm and a little mark on his foot. So my fans are going crazy again, sorry. Uh, we're going to go up one and make a Tetris triangle kind of shape like that. That's the detail on his foot. Now we're going to come up here and we're going to come two down from here. 
like that and place one take out them two blocks bring it down three so it's four in total and extend by six so three oops four five six should be looking like this we're gonna come out diagonal and down diagonal to the left down to the side one then we're gonna go down diagonal down diagonal again and extend by two like that that's his like hand that's his other hand um, now we just got to do the mouth and the eyes so for the eyes we come to this part here where it's three long we build it out one then place two blocks like that actually one down so it's one in one and then down then we're gonna place a four long block next to it gonna bring this out by two so it's three long same with the bottom fill it in and build two blocks on the end so that's one eye then we're gonna get our material a uh, random material bring it down by three place a black wall like that to the side one down diagonal and down down diagonal to the left down diagonal to the right or to the left again sorry I'm getting confused down or to the side down two down diagonal to the left and extend by three so four in total then we're going to go up diagonal and bring it up by four or three so four in total then we're going to bring this out so it connects like that and bring it out this way three then we're going to go up diagonal to the left and up one up diagonal to the right then up diagonal to the right again and connect it like that now for the last thing or the second last thing we're gonna build one in we're gonna make it day build a three long line double it up so it's a six so it's one gap six and then one so that's his like nose then we are going to get a random block go one up and build it out by two and we're gonna triple it so it's four high and do what the same as we did before so we place two on each side like that so that's pedo bear the outline and details complete um, all we need to do now is color him in so for the majority of the thing it is brown uh, there's only two or three patches where there's color so this patch here which is his tongue is pink wool oops now for this whole section here we're going to use smooth sandstone if you're on PC if you're on Xbox use sand because I'm not sure if smooth sandstone has come out on Xbox yet if it has just use smooth sandstone um, so we just fill this in like that now for the last part of color all we do is go up to the ears and build six block section like that and one down so that's the right ear for the left ear we again build a six block section but this time we add a little triangle on to make another separate square ish so it should look like that now for the rest of the bear he's just brown so I'm gonna pause the video fill him in and do the outro I'll be right back okay so I finished filling it in and that's what it looks like um, so if you enjoyed the tutorial or found it helpful uh, please give this video a like subscribe if you haven't uh, for more epic pixel art I guess so I'll see you in the next episode until then goodbye Pull my heart out of
off my chest, train my mind so I forget. Sink your teeth into my bones, dig me out, then fill the hole. Tell me apart.